Hey guys, Jimbo Evan here, and Tilly Doing is a mod showcase for too many items for Minecraft 1.8+. Uh, so to start off, guys, as you guys can see, if I try to do game mode 1 or anything, it says I don't have permission. But, with pretty much uh, too many items, you can do a lot of cool things. So first of all, you can turn cheats on. Therefore, you can go ahead and use commands like this. Also, it has so many cool things, so you can change your mode, survival, creative, adventure, uh, spectator mode. Uh, you can just do so much uh, with this thing, which is amazing. So we'll just go to creative mode right now. Uh, so then you you pretty much saw about the cheat mode. It turns cheats off if I don't have permissions. I can turn it from off to on, and then I'll get uh, pretty much cheats, and I can do stuff. Then uh, on pretty much on death, you keep items or you drop items. Therefore, if you die, you would keep your items instead of dying, which is pretty good. The difficulty, you can pretty much change that without worrying about anything, which is really good. Uh, you can turn off rain and snow. Uh, you can turn it on, off, whatever you want to do. It's really cool. Uh, prevent rain, on, off, whatever. Uh, the exact same thing. You can Then you can set the time. Uh, midnight, moonrise, moon, uh, sun. Uh, sorry, noon, I meant to say. Uh, so yeah, you can change the time of day. Then you can do hunger. So let's just go ahead and go out of creative. Uh, we'll just click here. So as you see, I'm right here. Let's go ahead and pretty much heal slash fill my hunger. You can move potion effects. So if you're pretty much in, uh, let's just grab a potion here. Uh, so say you have poison. Let's just throw that on ourselves. Uh, and we'll go out of this. I should really be using too many names. But you see I'm on this. Let's go ahead and remove the potion effects. They're gone. Uh, and you can just press this, and you can heal and fill your hunger. I believe also, uh, you could just press heal instead, and you won't have to worry about, uh, that. So what we'll quickly do is we'll just get another poison, uh, and we'll throw that on ourselves. So if you press heal, uh, it just heals you, doesn't, uh, get rid of the potion effect, but then you could, of course, use this and then heal. Uh, then infinite stacks, that thing's pretty good, so, uh, let's just show you. So I'll get a, bl a block of cobblestone. We'll first turn that off. Uh, and then we'll turn it on in a second. But yeah, you place a block. As you can see, you're losing blocks. Turn on infinite stacks. Uh, and you pretty much have infinite stacks of that block, which is pretty cool. So you can just keep on building if you're working on something, which is really, really awesome. Uh, so we'll just, we'll just, yeah. So that's just an example. Uh, then what you have is a few other things. Let's really quickly just go back to the game mode. And I don't know why I'm using that. I should really be using this. So that is pretty much uh, the controls. Then you have saves. So say you have like a stack of gold, you can save that and save one. Uh, then pretty much you can go ahead and load save one and you would get that gold yourself in that spot, uh, which is pretty cool. So yeah, you can save like a set of armor or something like that or a set of like tools or like a, a custom set of something. You can save it there. Uh, and you can have like any save you want. Uh, you can also rename them. So if I want to rename this set, uh, that I can have set 124 uh, if I really want to. But one to one to seven is not that bad. Uh, then you have some other things like custom. You can do custom things. So you can do custom flower pots with like a cactus in it. Uh, as you see, you can do custom. Uh, Let's just go back here. You can do custom enchanting potions, fireworks, signs, leathers, player heads, uh, notes, and then, of course, uh, flower pots, which is pretty cool. Uh, so you can pretty much customize them to whatever you want on the book, which is pretty cool. So I think you can do, like, efficiency uh, uh, that. Uh, let's see. So, yeah, you can do efficiency uh, enchantment 103 if you wanted to, which is crazy. And that's that's really efficient. Let, let's just go ahead and dig down really quickly. It won't be efficient here, of course, but then like look, that's how efficient it is. It's really efficient because of course it has to be, uh, which is really really cool. Uh, and then you can do that with like any possible thing, uh, which is really cool. So you can just do it with fireworks. Get like a certain firework, uh, like whatever you want the firework to be, and you can just have that, and it will do whatever the firework, uh, whatever you pretty much set it for in here. Uh, and then you just got some few other stuff. Uh, we won't really get into that uh, because you guys could try it out yourself the mod. Uh, and you can experiment with this stuff. A link to the mod will be in the description if you guys want to check it out. I suggest you do. Uh, then you pretty much have your item set where you can pretty much search for any type of item possible uh, in your item set here. Let's just go over here. Uh, but uh, so this is like my items. Uh, and then you have like the basic items over here. All the possible items that you need. 
Uh, it also shows up for pretty much lucky blocks because I have them in here. Uh, yeah, right here. Uh, but this is just like certain items that you have in a way. Uh, I believe these are like for mods and stuff like that. Uh, because I don't have them on me or anything like that. But yeah, these are for mods. So any mod that you would have would come here. I believe. I don't know exactly. Uh, but yeah, yeah, you can also. So you when your basic items, you can search for any item. Say you want a uh dirt i don't I'm just gonna write that and you can see oh i got uh normal dirt uh, right over here i got a uh, other uh other dirt and stuff like that which is pretty good uh and you can simply pretty much just take the dirt uh and like take it from here uh from there so like look you can take this you can take that uh and you could just simply just go here so let's just go to that dirt really quickly and let's just go ahead and take it right there um, and we can just take whatever items that we need from here and simply just put it in our crafting table. Uh, like I said, it's, it's like, it's mod compatible. You also get some command blocks and stuff like that, uh, which is pretty good. So let's just go to, uh, the lucky box. So yeah, it's mod compatible. As you can see, They're, they also have a few stacks. So click, will give you one stack. If, the, if it can't stack, then it'll give you a lot. Uh, then like a left click will give you one, uh, a shift left click will add it to your, my items. Oh, I almost forgot. That's what it was. Uh, so it will, be, it will pretty much get added to your items. So this is pretty much when you shift left click items out. I made a mistake there. Uh, but yeah, when you shift left click item, it will get added to your items. So say you need it for some sort of building project. You can also use your saves, but like you can have it there just to take it when you need it and stuff like that. I was thinking it was mods, but I forgot that I put it there on purpose. Uh, but uh, yeah, you can just do that. Get whatever item you need, put in your inventory. Uh, and especially with like turning on uh, the infinite sacks on, you pretty much never have to worry about losing uh, pretty much any sacks if you want to, which is really, really cool. Um, but yeah, that is pretty much it for this uh, pretty much mod showcase on too many items. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy this video, guys, be sure to hit that like button. And if you really enjoyed this video, guys, make sure to hit the subscribe button. Make sure to buy the Jimbo Oven Calf Network for 70% remnant share, guys. And one more thing, you can also press 0 to pretty much get rid of it or put it back on. Uh, but yeah, that's me, guys. This has been Jimbo Oven, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.